My name is Matthew Saige. I'm 25 years old. Uh, I'm a proud student at the American University of Antigua, and I'm in uh, internal medicine now, which is my first core rotation. And how do you like it? Um, I like it here. Uh, Kingsbrook is one of the better affiliates, they say, for internal medicine that AUA has. Uh, you learn a lot here, a lot of hands-on experience. Uh, the doctor to uh, student ratio is uh, very good, it's about uh, one to five, so there is s some one-to-one -one, uh, interaction going on. Uh, you do get your hands filled, and uh, it's very hands-on. I mean, you can do as much as you want or as little as you want, but uh, personally, I like to, you know, I'm a little ambitious, so I'm always, you know, full of work and always have my hands filled. Would, would you recommend Kingsbrook to friends? I would, uh, especially if you have a passion for internal medicine, at least. Uh, there's 800 beds here, 400 acute, and about 400 is a nursing home. So there's always patients for you. The ER is always slammed, the ICU, CCU. Uh, the doctors do a good job at um, taking care of patients, tri triaging what they need to. And um, you never be bored here. I mean, you, there's always new action going on, and medicine's always there, ready to be taught to you, and things you would never think you would see, only textbook, you'll be able to see here at Kingsbrook. What about academically and clinically? Academically, uh, we have lectures every single day, at least one to two hours, uh, with great, great professors and instructors. Dr. Varani, the pulmonologist, he's awesome here, he teaches us the majority of our lectures along with Dr. Ilyaev. Uh, we get the um, opportunity to have world-renowned Dr. Conrad Fisher here, Kaplan's uh, medical liaison. Uh, he's fantastic. You can't beat that. Everyone knows who he is. Um, I came, did clinical medicine here, introduction to clinical medicine with Dr. Wally, who was fantastic, taught us a lot, and the whole UME staff, Mr. Romero, they're on top of what they're doing, and uh, I think they're organized, structured, and they have a good head on their shoulders. They're guiding students the right way, and people are very successful and prosperous coming out of um, Kingsbrook. They teach their students well, and um, you can definitely see that based on where their students go from here and the residencies they obtain. Would you come back for electives? I am. Uh, I am going to be scheduled most of my electives here. I'm doing family medicine here next, and then surgery a few months later, psychiatry, and then most of my electives will be here. Um, like I said, I've been, done, been here about five months now, so I know most of the doctors, professors here, and I love it, and they're more than willing to take me on. And you and me here is very accommodating to what you need and scheduling electives. What would you change? What needs improvement? Um, well... Nothing's perfect, I guess. Um, what needs improvement is, because this is an inner city hospital, it's not a big trauma center university, uh, you do see a lot, but there's limited to what you're gonna see. Um, given Brooklyn's uh, geographic area, there's about 14 hospitals within Brooklyn. Trauma center is down the street from here. So what comes into Kingsbrook, um, it's fascinating, you'll learn a lot, but if you're looking for the trauma, uh, you know, the gore, what you're going to see on TV, it's not going to be really, you're not going to find it here. The ORs aren't slammed like that with, with life or death uh, trauma coming in uh, and OR bays slammed. Um, it's not like that. It's more because uh, it's inner city. You're going to see a lot of people come in uh, who don't have a primary medical doctor. They're going to come to the emergency room. They know Kingsbrook doctors are good at what they do. And... Um, the treatment they're going to get here, I could say because it's not a trauma center, is more personal. So you have that family doctor type of care you're going to get here, which is the positive side. There's a negative and a positive. I said you're not going to see so much trauma and hands-on level one, but you get that homey family one-on-one, -on -one, I know my doctor, rapport here, which is something you won't get in most places.